It doesn't matter where you live in the valley. If you've got a phone and a computer, you're a target for scammers. I've never seen so many people hit so hard by scam calls and emails as I am right now. So, all this week, I'm looking at the worst of them, starting tonight as I try to give these idiots a taste of their own medicine. I asked one, two, three, four, five. And you sent seven, eight, nine, ten. She gave me about 45 calls. Hundreds of numbers from telemarketers and scammers you wrote down. Had two charges that will be filed against me. And now, let's give it a shot. I'm calling them back. The number you have dialed is not in service at this time. Been disconnected. Your call cannot be completed as dialed. Ready to tell someone off. Finally, I get a working number. Says that she's been bothered by you guys. She's on the do not call list and she doesn't want you to call her again. Yes. Then another number goes through. And yet you keep calling day and night. But most don't work because many aren't real. You can't listen to this, I'm done. For 30 bucks, websites like this allow phone number spoofing. Pick a fake number before you call and the receiver will see the number instead of yours. That and low cost voice over internet make it easy for scammers to call from anywhere and hide. One scammer number belonged to a California congressman. Another dials a phone company warning. It's likely why scammers are so threatening. They expect to get your money the first time because they're not set up for callbacks. So when you do get hold of one, I spoke in a made up foreign language that made absolutely no sense. Throw it back in their face. Is this a scam? I felt better even if they didn't learn a thing. You hung up on me. Nice. Block the calls if you can, use caller ID for numbers you know, let the others go to voicemail, and for emails, I never click on links. Scam Week continues tomorrow at 6 with one that's using threats and a famous comedian's name. Go to ABC15.com, click on sections and let Joe know. Tell me what you're seeing. Here's how to do that. I'm investigator Joe Ducey. If you've got a problem, let me know.